Okay, this is Bach Raji back at you. Playing the true chop, true trend method. And we're going to go for the chop. We're starting at 15852 $10 win here. Let's see if we can pull it off. Back to my $5 chips, just realizing that these bets can and will probably get high. Uh, yes, we'll keep playing. Okay, let's get a nice, quick, easy win would be just lovely today. Sixes are good. And we tied. So we're going to re-bet. This shoe, ooh, it would have been a little bit challenging for us. Of course, there's no only one four pattern. So it wouldn't have been horrible. I had a comment. I think someone was watching a, one of my earlier videos of just trying to win every day or every session, really. Um, 10 bucks. And that turned us into a pretty good number there. Nice. And um, the comment was, you know, you, you can't always just play chops. Well, we don't. This is, oh, we got to wait for the deal. So what we're playing is, just to be clear, is we're playing the chop, right? But if we lose on three sides, in other words, if the chop doesn't hit three times, we will then go for the trend. So it's a two-part system. It's not just the chop. It's also the trend. Because, you know, I've learned the hard way, uh, fighting trends um, can uh, be uh, devastating. And you don't want that. What's Roger right say? Oh, okay. Yeah, that's his wife, Bev. Okay, we're going to wait to see and play the chop. I don't feel a chi bet. And sometimes I'll do, do what's called a chi bet, which means I'll, if I think banker's going to win for whatever reason, I'll bet banker. If I think player's going to win, I'll bet player. So, you know, I do go by what I think may happen. Okay, so I'm going to go for what's called now the chop. Right? Banker won. Now we're playing player. It's chop. But if we lose three times over here, then we'll say, okay, well, maybe banker's ready to go 10 in a row. Which is very, I've seen it happen. I've seen 22 players in a row. But not on this particular site. Ooh, yeah, it's going to be rough. Okay, kind of saw that coming. So we do the bear and we go up to 10. After that, we'll go one more, and then we will have four bankers in a row, and then we'll go for the trend. And if we lose three times over that, then it'll be three players, and we go for the trend. So time, sometimes it'll be a four pattern, sometimes it'll be a three pattern. No, oh, six are hard to beat. They're hard to beat. Ooh. What was that about?
That should have been a player win, so I don't know. Something went awry. Oh. Okay. Ah. <laughs> well, <laughs> that didn't help us. So we go again. She made a mistake. Or the action of it was her. It could have been the software. Oh, give me something good for player right now. That's not <laughs> that's not good for player. Oh, we won. <laughs> so we'll take our bets back down. I do go back to base bet when I'm at a five dollar uh, table limit. Okay, so let's see if we can't pull a chop off here. Mm, that's a three against a five. Fives can be dangerous. Ooh, I think we're in good, good shape. And bam! Another quick and easy $10 win. Very nice. I like this. I like this. I like this a lot. I like it when it's a quick, easy win. Doesn't take a whole lot of time. And I'm going for 10 bucks a day. Eventually, um, we'll, we'll try to probably go for a little higher amount. Just want to get used to playing at this level. And I know that there are times when this thing's going to get pretty crazy. Um, let me see. If I can go to this site here. Okay. This is another site you can play on. So let's go. Um, so we have a little more time here. Right. For the newcomers are just checking this thing out. So what I do is we start off with the chop. Then we go player. For the chop. And we go again. And then we play the chop. Because chop one. And the chop. And the chop. Okay. Why did we lose? Well, player one. Why did player one? This is Bakra. Whoever comes closest to nine. That's a nine. As high as you can get, wins the hand. Sometimes both banker or player and banker will have a nine, and that would be a tie. Tie is not the best bet. Some people like playing it. It's got bad odds. So how do we come up with a one? Wow, well, we have a face card. That's a zero. Then we have a nine plus two. That's, that's 11. We drop off the 10 value, leaving us with a one. Wow, what we got here? Well, we got 4 plus 8 is 12. We drop off the 10 value. That's 2 plus 7 is how we get our 9. Okay. So, um, we're going to rebet. Still going for that chop. I kind of want to lose this hand here. No, we didn't. 
Okay, so now let's see if we can't get this to 300 real quick. Now, there's two schools of thought, racing back down a bit or not. We're not going to race down a base bet. Let's see how that works for us. Second loss on this side. Third loss on this side. One. First loss. We won. Lost. One. Lost. Lost that one. Now we'll go for the trend. I hope I don't lose this one now. Good. So I want to show that we do go for the trend. Let's see if this trend takes off. It did not. It's okay. Back down to 150. Not going back down to base bed at all. 125. 100. Chops are doing good. 75. Lost it. One more loss here. We'll go for the trend. Okay, good. We're at 150. And we're going for the trend. Didn't hit it. 175. One fifty back up to one seventy five. Bets are getting high up to two hundred now. Now, you know, this is bets are going to climb when you're not racing back down to base bet, but you're going to see something interesting. Chop is winning. Chop is doing good. And we just won and we were not back down to base bet. So you don't have to race back down to base bet. I'm not that comfortable yet at the five dollar lim limit late la, 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 to do that. But uh if you really want to take advantage of the dealer bear system, it's best to have a win goal and and I think just stay with with straight out playing it, but you've got to have a good bankroll. And be willing to realize you're gonna you're gonna suffer some losses, and your bets are gonna get high. The only solace you can take is the fact that you know you will know that you will not have to get back down to base bet to be okay. You got you got to know when to quit, right? I mean, you have to have a goal and when to stop. When you stop playing, well, whatever you're comfortable losing, uh, unfortunately, I hope you know gamble responsibly. Obviously, I'm very careful. Just going for ten dollar wins at this particular time, but that'll change. I'll, I'll, I'll want to go for more later on. Um, but right now, it's great return on investment. So, great video. I wanted to show that uh, the system is two pronged, and even if um, the trend doesn't take off, as long as you've got uh, uh, this is a trend in itself. When you just have a lot of chops in a row, it's a choppy trend. Then you have these kind of trends, but. Sooner or later, you will get a dragon, and that, that's always a great thing to get. And you don't want to miss that opportunity. And like I said, racing back down to base bet, mm, you know, I really feel comfortable at the dollar level on that racing back down to base bet. So when I start going for more than $10 a day, I'll go back down to dollar units, play a little longer, and not race back down to base bet and try to win 15 bucks a session. Really should call it a session, not a day. Because I can't – I just – I can't do it every single day. I try to do it as often as I possibly can. So we're just going to start calling it. Uh, this would be, I think, uh, my 14th session of this new style of playing. So we've made $140 so far, you know, doing this system. And um, we had one day where it's got really brutal. That's going to happen. Shout out to Gambler54. He knows that. Anybody that's uh, been playing this for a long time, 
knows that this game can get rough on you. So um, next video, um, I, may, I may go for 15, a $15 win and use dollar units, but not race back down to base bet and and see if we can't maybe maybe get a fifteen dollar win slowly increase our win our, slowly increase our winnings okay appreciate all the comments subscriptions um i make my money off of uh off of playing so i just uh it's nice to have people join in i, I if you follow what i show you you will make money if you have the proper bankroll and discipline it's not big amounts that you'll win, but you're going to win. You can always win 10, 15 bucks. Chill. Get back on. Win another 10, you know, no reason why you can't win 100 bucks a day if you really, you know, had the time. Okay. This is Bakraji signing out.